The client's objectives up front are almost always blurred and it falls upon us to distill the options and come up with one clear picture as to exactly what the house should look like. The inspiration of the house came from a visit to Provence where I had seen a beautiful French Norman house. When I was interviewed by the clients, that was the house that I had in the back of my head. And then as we got further along, I showed them images of the house in Provence. It became very clear to them as to exactly what the house should look like. The client mentioned how excited she was with the design because we were actually listening to them. And that's a very important skill that we've acquired over the years to make sure that we listen to the client's requirements instead of just going off on our own and thinking that we know everything because we don't. So the way this house is cited is to take advantage of the view of the lake in the back but also in a way that it offers privacy from the street. So proportion and scale are actually paramount in the design of any home. So is style and so is size. Everything put together makes for a nice design. What makes this house livable for a family in spite of its size are the details which add cohesiveness, scale, warmth. It was really important to the clients to make sure that the spaces that were used would overlook the wall garden and the terrace in the back of the house overlooking the lake. Water has a certain feature, element, that evokes something in everybody's mind and heart. And walking over water to come to the front door by itself is like magic. We decided to have the bridge, a little courtyard, an unusual feature, but it adds so much cohesiveness and warmth to the scale of the house that it's like the clients fell in love with it. I love it too. I have many favorite features in this house, starting with this room that we are. It's designed front to back with oversized windows that don't look oversized. And that's the key. And of course, the clients were very responsible for many of the touches. They asked for things that were unusual, like the spa, the spa that you would find in a triple A quality hotel someplace, or the basketball court, which was like, wow. I mean, the kids can stay home and play and have a great time. Over the years, we have developed the skill to do any style home, whether it's 2,000 square feet or 20,000 square feet, that fits seamlessly into the landscape. I consider myself a hands-on person. I don't like to be interviewed, be given the work, and then hand it off to somebody else. That doesn't work. I like to stay involved every step of the way.